This is a special night honoring a special broadcaster. Salt Lake Bees paying tribute to their longtime radio voice tonight after his death last week. News specialist Andrew Adams was there and spoke with fans. Andrew, a great tribute tonight. Well, it really was. From special insignias on the field to uniforms to a moment of silence, the organization paid its respects in several ways, and fans took time to remember as well as they took in the game. On a picture-perfect night at the ballpark, there was plenty to cheer. And yet for many in the crowd, thoughts were elsewhere. He could uh, tell a story, paint a picture, so it felt like you were, you were at the ball game. Lonnie Anderson couldn't help but remember the longtime voice of the Salt Lake Bees, Steve Klauke. Insurmountable amount of knowledge and, and uh, game-telling, storytelling uh, ability. And he wasn't the only one thinking about it. I loved it when there was a home run, you know, because you could feel it happening as he spoke. Gone. That unforgettable voice was prematurely silenced last week when Klauke was hit by a car and killed in a crosswalk. He's the one that actually told me about it. But I just think it's sad because he's, he was a great announcer. Tonight, though, was about reflecting on the good times. The voice of summer. And what Klauke meant to the organization. As we the bees recognized the broadcasting legend with a moment of silence. It's going to be missed a lot. Fans say they'll never forget that voice. It was the best at his craft. There was nobody better. A voice that will live on in memory forever. He was just a gem for this, this state and, and this community. A yeah, really nice night here tonight. Really good sized crowd given it was a weeknight game and the Bees took care of business in front of the home crowd. Sports will have more on that a little bit later in the show. Back to you. It's going to be missed. What a legacy he leaves behind. Nice tribute, though. Thank you, Andrew.